let's pot up these cherry tomatoes. This is a Burpee XL seed stirring tray. If you've never used it, this is how they work. You just pull your whole block out like this, and then your cell is left empty and clean, and it's just as nice as can be. Carefully put the back in, and it's got rows are labeled. So there's side one and side two, and then A, B, C, D. So this is side 1D, and I have a little key, a little legend that tells me that 1D is all cherry tomatoes. And you know what? They're going to break apart just fine, and it's going to look great. So here's how it works. I usually just find the one that's kind of off on its own the most and start with that. So that's going to be this big, strong one right here. And then slow, slow and easy. Some roots will break. It's okay. But once you get it a little bit free, you're just going to wiggle, 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 wiggle. Wiggle! Try not to force, try not to snap the roots if you can. Just wiggle, 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 and they will eventually come free. Now here's one cherry tomato, and then we'll set this I'm down carefully. This. We'll come back to it. Good job, buddy. Can I have one? Thank you. We're going to put these in peat pots because these are my giveaways. I'm going to help you. And tomatoes get planted deep, if you didn't know that. Uh, Toss a little in the anyone? bottom. Anyone? Hold this dude in the center. And then I had some in pots, but my little helper over here is dumping them all into Come one in. for me. Oh, you. You're a good helper, bud. I'm, I'm a good helper. With any tomato, you want to plant it deeper Can than it was in your starter because tomatoes will grow adventitious roots along the stem. So if this is your stem and previously these were your roots down here, and you bury it up to here, you will get roots in this space branching out. I don't know if that's easy, even a good explanation. But always bury your tomatoes deep because that will help them grow additional roots to support the plant and then you'll get more and more yields. So here's cherry tomato number one. Now, I made a grave mistake last year and I gave away a whole bunch of tomato plants and I mislabeled them because, I don't know, life. So I ended up giving my mom four, I think four or six tomato plants and it was supposed to be like two beefsteak, two Roma, and two cherry and it was two cherry, two cherry, two cherry. So she ended up with six cherry tomato plants and was super sick of tomatoes by the end of the summer. That's all she had. She didn't have any like big tomatoes for canning for sauces, just all cherry tomatoes. So anywho, label it now before you get busy and forget. One at a time. One at a time. Cherry Tom. Close enough. Cherry Tom. Cherry Tom. What? And then you just want to water it in gently and rinse and repeat. 